Welcome back to more Resident Evil Zero. This way! Okay. Today we are going to go ahead and finish up the training facility. Should be good times. And I want to reiterate my love and affection for this god-awful inventory system. There are items I wanted to go pick up that now have spawned enemies guarding so I can't get to them because they're not just normal zombies, they're other enemies. I hear some creepy crawlies down there. I hope we don't have to go deal with them later. And it's just been a fairly decent amount of bullshit. Just to get this far, I actually need Billy for this because he's got the key. So I'm going to have to be kind of strategic with my inventory. Because we've only got a couple of slots left. Part of that is my fault for making a bit of a poor decision here. Let's switch over to Rebecca. I got, went ahead and made some Molotovs. The ones that I wanted to pick up are the items that I was mentioning before that are now being guarded by an enemy. So, are you? I'll go check over there. Yeah. yeah you stay there. Shoot. Or throw! Throw! Dead! That's just nasty. I think it is. Alright, we're good. Let's go! Okay. And running everywhere trying to track down your items is kind of annoying. It's an interesting little gimmick, but at the end of the day, it's kind of a pain in the ass. Nap these. Let's see what else we gotta do. I'll go check over there. Yeah. No, Rebecca, you're gonna stand right there for a second. While Billy plays the piano. It's so beautiful. I love it. It's no Moonlight Sonata, though. Hey, secret passage. Who didn't see that coming? Even I saw that coming. <laughs> okay, that wasn't funny at all. Let's just go see what's the what in here. Come on, Rebecca. I said, let's see what's the what. I know you're worried. Maybe a bit scared, but it's okay. And fortunately, with all this... I was really surprised to realize how many of the gas canister is actually in there. So now that we got that, I can go ahead and nab these. Magnum shells. I'll be doing a lot more inventory stuff after we get done with this first little segment that y'all won't be subjected to. Come on. There you go. Oh no, it's closing! What are we going to do? I wonder what would happen if you put Billy right there where that was closing. How that would work out. Fortunately, if you're not a moron, then this is a simple way of getting her back out. Plus, you get to hear the wonderful rendition of whatever song this is by Billy, except I'm talking over it. Damn it, I want Moonlight Sonata! I hope there's, like, sheet music up there. I didn't look at that. Because otherwise, I don't know if he just randomly played something. Yeah, okay, it looks like there's sheet music there. Cool. So, let's get out of here. This way. Okay. We're going to need Rebecca for the next part as well. For some reason, this leech man that we killed likes to spawn a bunch of leeches. It's kind of annoying. For the most part, you can step on them. They're not going to take off much health, I wouldn't think. I'll go alone. Okay. No, oh, actually, Rebecca's going to go alone. And... Are they equipped? 
They're not. Okay. I am going to want those Molotovs. Throw, Rebecca, throw! Your life depended on it! Let's go! Okay. Okay, and he doesn't actually. I'll check it out. Okay. Well, now you're in my way, so that's kind of annoying. Need that. This way. Roger. Fantastic. Did you really need to take the time to do the gesture? Okay, I have trouble getting in and out of that stupid room. But we made it. I'm tempted to go save again. Watch. Oh. She was going to start tossing them. Okay, where the hell do we go now? Oh, God damn it, Billy. I'd like a song entitled, Like a Retard, and de dedicate it to Billy. What the fuck was that? Okay, are you guys following each other again? No, you're not. Okay. I think this is the room we need to go in. There is a trap room in here as well, so you don't want to go in the wrong one. I like how Billy's this big burly dude and I'm having Rebecca do everything. Yeah, there's zombies in here. Rebecca? Uh, Rebecca! Yeah, you might want to shoot the zombie that's coming at you. Probably a good idea. And Billy didn't come in here with me. Son of a bitch. Hang on. And this Roger. asshole was going to walk into the fucking trap room. I hope I got all the zombies. Because if not, I'm going to be irritated. We need to come over here. I think it's right here. If I'm on the wrong pixel, I'll cut to when I succeed. Awesome. So I was a little off. I guess you gotta be right over here. And I need to pick that up, wherever the hell that is. There we go. We got one more thing to pick up in here. I don't exactly know where it is, so I'm going to cut until I find it. And I'm not going to have to do that because I found it. Yay! I don't know if there's any health or anything else in here. Uh, switch back to Rebecca. De-equip the gun. I think that's everything we need to do in this godforsaken hallway. I tried this like three times and just kept having problems. So far they've been kept to a minimum. Okay, trap room is over there. There are actually plenty of supplies in there, which is nice, especially health if you need it. But it will spawn another leech man out there, which granted we have Molotovs and we can deal with them, but we don't really have the space for all those items anyway, so... Hopefully Billy continues to follow me this time. Yeah, I wanted to go pick up some other Molotovs. It turns out we actually have plenty, and there's some some of those fucking monkey things decided to spawn. Okay, so I'm trying to think what we gotta do next. We gotta go get another plate. Right, and then I gotta do inventory stuff. And I wanna experiment with something in this room we progress but I'll do that off screen after we pick up the last of these plates and then I gotta figure out where I dropped one of them because I'm pretty sure I dropped one down here somewhere and I have no idea where that is that's gonna be awesome good times that would be the plate from the last video that I didn't have enough space to pick up in that one room by that animal puzzle I'll show me getting it here in a bit I'll go check over there. Billy, you just okay. wait here. 
You're not really going to be useful to me right now. I like that my ink ribbons, I actually have like 26 left. I'm like, holy shit, they actually give you a lot of stuff. Which is nice. It kind of makes sense since you're going to be separated. You can't build up a stash of items. It kind of makes sense, actually. I'm looking for a place for a battery. I think I see it, but there she is. Okay. This should be it right here. But, of course, the game is not going to be nice enough to just automatically set me up with a battery. Nope, I got to do it myself. Because fuck me, that's why. Now we need to call a lift. I think when I originally did this, I made this a lot more complicated than it needed to be. I can't remember now. I just remember having to fast forward the section. Okay, Rebecca, you could have been walking towards the thing while it was coming down. That way we would be wasting less time. I'm going to need you to climb up there. Thank you. Unless I accidentally pushed the stupid thing. And then that would have upset me. Yep. This is what you're getting. More box pushing action. I hope I can do one more. Come on. I don't want to get this thing stuck someplace where I have to exit and re-enter the room. Okay, I'm going to have to use the tank controls for this because she's not wanting to... There we go. That is one thing I really like about this in Remake, these remastered versions of them. I like having both the tank controls and the analog stick. If you get good at both of them, then you can pretty much use whichever one works best for a given situation, which is really cool. Oh, God damn it! I think you can actually explore the little exterior to this little courtyard area, but there, I don't remember there being anything there. I mean, I suppose it's possible and I just didn't see it. Alright, is that going to be good enough? I think it is. Okay. Okay, that should be right. And then she proceeds to run away from the thing instead of climbing up it. Awesome! Okay. Well, I got it. In the end. It was a little bit annoying, but not as bad as I thought it was going to be. And I've tried this so many times, I cannot remember if I said it already. Follow me. I went ahead... I'm hitting the wrong button again. That's okay. I went ahead and got the hook shot because we're going to need that for a segment coming up. I've got one tablet there, one tablet there, and I need to find the other one. So I'm going to go ahead and save an inventory. And this is the room with that remaining tablet that I didn't have enough space to pick up last time. I had to run all the way back here to get it. Now I've gone ahead and taken care of all my inventory stuff I want to do for the time being. I am going to do a little more, but that's more stuff that y'all are not going to see. I basically just wanted to arrange my inventory the way I'm going to need it for this next little part. As you can see, I now have all three of those stones. You just wait there, I'll Billy. Go. Okay. No. I'm going to take these things on with a handgun. It's going to go great, right? should already know what they are since... We've heard the sound they're making before. You should be able to hear them. Die! I don't think they can actually get you here. You dead? I think they are. Not? Well, I'm screwed. Okay... Yeah, that's actually where I want to... Whoa, 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 camera, camera, come on. 
That is actually where I want to go, is this way. This way! And this will save us some time. Yeah, you can actually take those things out there. I saw that on a video years ago, right around the time I first did this game. So it would have been 2012. So the annoying thing about this next segment is... Well, one, I need to find the little ladder to get down there. Not quite sure where that is. Here? It is. Beautiful. Two. I don't have each one of these things that we need with just one character. As you can see, they all got to be placed somewhere. Well, right here. Hopefully, they automatically go where they're supposed to go, or I'm going to be upset and cry. No. I'm not going to cry. Man, men don't cry! There we go. Now we just gotta place the other one in here. Last one. And that opens up. Now, something I do remember, I think that might have changed the layout of the tower. And if it did, then I'm screwed. I'm just gonna check real quick. I kind of remember that being a thing. Yeah, we're not doing that. Okay. Well, that's not good. So I am going to be cut off from my handgun bullets and uh, my shotgun shells. Fuck. Hmm. I'll get us to the next save point, I guess. I'm gonna have to redo that because... I don't like being cut off from all my shit. I can at least put two of those three down and go and grab... Yeah, I think I can do this. I can go and grab a couple of the things I need, but I'll go ahead and take us to the next save point. I'll go alone. Roger. Actually... He'll stay right there. The soundtrack in this area reminds me a little bit of the police station theme in Resident Evil 2. And more teamwork for a puzzle. There's an item there too. I'm curious what that will be, but we'll find out. At some point, I suppose. You know I'm going to check to see what item it was. If you know anything about my videos, how obsessed I am with gathering items, you know I'll check. Nope, I'm pretty sure I forget to check what that item was. Yep, we are in the church. The church shouldn't take too long. And we have not heard this music in a long time. Sorely missed. So there are ink ribbons there. Technically, I could just nab those and not worry about grabbing the other ones. First aid spray. I will be taking that. Looks like shotgun shells. Yep. And it looks like there might be... It looks like there's two boxes of ammo there. I can't tell if they're both shotgun shells or what the second one is here. 
Let's find out. That would be kind of silly for them to both be shotgun shells. Yeah, okay. Napalm rounds. Sweet. So I went ahead and brought over some shit. I need to equip the grenade launcher. And we just got really good grenade rounds. I got all my ink ribbons with me. I got my shotgun shells here. There's some napalm rounds down here. I will go nab them shortly. Now I gotta find the door out of here. That's where it was. For y'all, it was just a couple of seconds since I walked in here. For me, it was probably about 10 minutes. What you're trying to do here is stun lock this thing, so you can just keep shooting it. Ooh -hoo -hoo -hoo! I kicked his ass! And, kind of unfortunate, I believe I still have three rounds of grenades left. That's not good. I mean, I'm happy to have them, but... Still. Alright, so I'm going to go back in here and do some inventory stuff. Right, so that got taken care of. Now, there is a section over here where we need to use the hook shot, and the game's even telling us that. Before we do that, I do want to see what this item was here. Never mind, apparently I did look at it. Okay, that'll be useful. So can I now get Rebecca back in there? Because there are items that I do want to pick up if I can. This might seem like a waste of time to everybody else, but for me, it's going to be useful. Okay, Billy, you just stay right there. Alright, so I did some inventorying. That's the inventory for Billy, that's the inventory for Rebecca. For the time being, we need to use this hookshot. I was debating whether or not I would be better off with the three grenade shells or the first aid spray, but I decided to go with ammo. I feel like there will be enough health, hopefully, throughout the area to where I shouldn't have to worry, especially with as few slots as we have. There are some herbs out here, too, somewhere, if you want to bother to go and look for them. I actually remember this area being a little more extensive than it is. Ah, dang it. Putting Rebecca in there means I can't just call her, son of a bitch. Ah, here we go. I did something. I did a thing! Let's regroup. Okay. Ah, okay. The elevator was right over here. That's why. Okay. Fair enough. It's Thursday now. I want to finish this game by this weekend. Editing is not going to be fun. The only video I put together is the first one, so that's going to be a right pain in my ass. And I really want to start Kuon, hopefully pretty soon. Of course, what I want and what actually happened could be two different things. We'll have to see. Alright. I much prefer playing as Rebecca. I don't know why. I just... Alright, is this the room? If it's not, I'm gonna cry. And I'm not even joking. Especially if I get attacked. It's not? Alright, it is the right room, so we're good. There's shit in here. I can't remember. I think zombies end up showing up in here later, and that's not gonna be fun for anybody. But there's also an ink ribbon in here, which we're going to want to use. I think that's where we use the hook shot coming up. That'll be next video's problem, though. 
There we go. Yes, I know, game. Alright, so I'm going to save my game and we're going to end it here. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.